Middle school is difficult because that's where students typically begin to disconnect from education. If students do not have a good middle school experience, then it will lead to them either disconnecting again in high school from education or they, they won't return at all. In 2006, in Cleveland alone, 660 ninth grade students didn't return to high school. Success in middle school at EPREP begins the first day of class. The structure in our building, uh, the rigorous academics, a great curriculum package. Uh, all of our teachers who are just crazy and overzealous about what it is that they do, we all have one goal in mind, and that is to prepare our kids for college prep, high school, and beyond. When I first started at EPREP, I hated the school. Walking on the right side of the hallways, binders in your left hands, no talking. I felt real closed in and felt like I wasn't going to be able to make it through the rest of the year because it was so hard. It's a lot of rules, a lot of homework, and you'll have no time for yourself. Everything was so strict and so quiet. It gave me like a nervous feeling. So it, it was like a whole new world. At the end of sixth grade, I started to change and my attitude towards the school started to become better because I actually opened up to more people and gained a lot of friends and gained close relationships with the teachers. Um, I saw that the teachers worked hard for me, which made me want to work even harder. I started to see myself change. I started to see my grades go up. I started to see the teachers compliment me more on my actions in class. I began to focus more on getting my work done, getting into college, doing things with good quality. Just realized here I'm not going to get away with nothing, so I might as well just do it right the first time. And once I learned to love learning, I really like EPREP. EPREP takes trips to businesses and colleges so that we know more about the world that's out there so we can get better prepared for when we get out of school. Last year we went to McKenzie and Company. We had lunch with them. We broke off into groups with some of the workers. We learned like what their part of the job was, like what was their input. And while we were there, I got to do a speech about my, my journey with EPREP. EPREP's new location will be at Tyler Village. It's gonna be an awesome experience for our students and our teachers. Think of this, an entrepreneurial school located in an entrepreneurial environment. Even though it's the beginning of the school year, our eighth graders are already preparing for high school. We've hand selected a number of high performing college prep high schools for our kids to attend. There are so many great choices to choose from, it could be overwhelming to pick just one. And just recently, we took a field trip to Horizon Science Academy and St. Martin de Porres. I got to see what a high school experience is like, how you transition, how they eat lunch in the large cafeteria, you know. Shadowing is basically when you follow a student around in their daily activities to see what the school is like. It's a lot of fun. You get to meet new people, and everybody's so warm, opening, and honest. It actually made me feel a lot more relaxed. We take a high school placement course. So right now we're going through the application process. We're doing mock interviews. I was nervous in the beginning. She said that I said the words like a lot, but once I warmed it up to her, she said I did very well. Politics. I want to be a lawyer when I get older. Okay, very good. What makes you want to do that? I just love debating on topics and I love fighting for justice. Probably the fourth or fifth time that I've been down here and I'm even more so impressed every time I come down to, to just see how well prepared these guys are, how well spoken they are, and, and just nice kids. Yeah, and you interview a lot better than a lot of college students or even people I work with. So again, keep up the good work and I, I have no doubt that you'll go on and do great things and go to college. It was nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too, thank you for your time. I'm really excited about attending high school because I really just want to step out of my boundaries and meet new people and, and try new things and explore new hobbies. I am kind of nervous, but at the same time, I feel confident that I can get into the high school and do what I got to do so I can get into college. Well, E-Prep has taught me principles such as respect and hard work and discipline, and I'm going to keep those principles with me when I go off to high school. When I first came here and I went to the interview, they said, you are guaranteed to go to college. I didn't really believe them. But now after going here for a couple years, I see that they were right. 
My favorite subjects are science and history, so I like to be an archaeologist. I would like to become a lawyer, mainly because I like to talk and I gotta ask for everything. I would like to be a sports journalist, uh, maybe for one of the NBA teams or MLB teams. When I get out of college, I want to be a robotics engineer, so I'll be designing space shuttles, doing a lot of things for the government, maybe even making robots. I've loved my experience here. I mean, I've met a lot of great people, and I've really felt that here, learning's fun. E-Prep is an excellent school. It's preparing us for our future, preparing us for college. It opens new doors for you. As inner city kids, you'll never expect that one day you could be a businesswoman or you could be famous, you know. And E-Prep has taught us that we can be whatever we want to be. We just have to work hard to get there.